let's say Harambe never died and you were on the moon. Since the moon has lower gravity, jumping or throwing things would be easier compared to Earth. Emulating reality, if we reduce the gravity in TF2, jumping would send us higher and pipes would turn upwards. And the opposite would happen if we increased gravity. So with that in mind, how do you think the payload cart would react? That's right, it should start violently backflipping. Normally, gravity in TF2 defaults to 800. If we change that to negative a million, it first begins ominously floating, and when it reaches the first checkpoint, this seems to be an issue with trying to go downhill if gravity is too negative, since this spinning performance happens on the downward end of the checkpoint every time. Each time this happens, it also first does a small rotation before spinning wildly. Since the issue is about going downhill, this also happens on the ramp between the second and third checkpoint. But this is somehow not as bad as it gets. Something about this ramp on bad water last really upsets the payload. And for the payload's final form, positive 9.9 .9 million gravity. Simply pushing the cart is already very difficult. The cart's invisible soul tries its best to continue forward, but the physical half is suffering from absolutely crippling anxiety. When we finally get to the checkpoint, I can't even begin to try and understand what's happening here. There are times where it goes off into the second point. Sometimes it goes back through the tunnel. or face through the gate. It just has a mind of its own. What the hell's going on? <laughs> uh, rapidly rotating vehicle.